In this question, we are told that atoms overlap different types of orbitals to form sigma or pi bonds. The first part would like us to draw how two atoms with sp2 hybridized orbitals would overlap orbitals to form a sigma bond. sp2 hybridized means that we're going to have three lobes. So I'll draw a nucleus and one, two, three lobes around that atom. That's the first center. The other atom also has three lobes, and since I want the orbitals to overlap, I will point this one toward the other atom and draw the three lobes. And right here, what you can see is that we have an overlap of two hybridized orbitals pointed directly at each other, and this would be a sigma bond. For the next one, we want to draw how two atoms with unhybridized p orbitals would overlap to form a pi bond. So here's one nucleus, and here is its p orbital. Here is the other nucleus and its p orbital. And since we'd like to form a pi bond, we want them to overlap sideways. So as I move these two atoms closer to one another, we're going to wind up with the nuclei close and an overlap region above and below the plane defined by the two atoms. And that's how you do that.